good early afternoon because it's not even two. I got off work early because it was Association Appreciation Week. <laughs> she loves me. Okay, so we literally just started this diet. And we got some magical mail from <laughs> our lovely friends. So, well, first these cookies. Peter had like a cookie exchange at work today. So this is all. I couldn't not take any. Like they wouldn't let me. Cookies. And there's some good looking ones oh in there, so it'll be hard. Okay, and then Caroline and Sean. We'll put their link up above to their vlogs. Yeah. They're amazing. They're our, new, our friends from Newcastle. Yeah. We've said it before. They're literally like the UK version of us. They really are. And they're great. They got Eve these bedtime biscuits. Which we tried last, last night. Um, awesome. And I think they worked out pretty well. Yeah. And then this is like Peter's thing. Is chocolate oranges. Chocolate oranges. Yeah. Everything. So we, we decided, last time they sent us stuff, we literally were done within and like, like a weekend. Yeah. So this time around, we're gonna eat like one a day. Not even for some of them. And then we got these cute coasters. Mr. Which and Mrs. we love coasters because all of our surfaces mean a lot to us and we can't <laughs> put drinks on them. Yeah. And this cute ornament. This is good to be home keychain. A birthday card for me, so thank you so yeah. much. I loved it and loved the pin. And then this ornament. So cool, it's like landmarks where they live. And this is my favorite part right here. <laughs> this dictionary of all the lingo in the UK. Yeah, I think it's actually like specifically to where they live is oh. this like, do you say Gordy maybe? Gordy or Gordy. <laughs> um, so yeah, that is super cool. And then and we get this our cool, other this, thing we got. We kind of knew, because we talked to, to Caroline and John a lot, so we kind of knew something was coming, but this was a surprise. Yeah. This is from, Chris and Melinda. So it's vinyl lettering that we're gonna put in our office above our computer where we edit our vlogs. And it says, it's so good to be home. Isn't that it's so perfect sweet? perfect for us. And the same font, like it's probably <laughs> from the same-ish company, on a keychain that Sean and Carolyn got, it says, it's so good to be home. It's so sweet. I think sweet. we need to contact this company and be like, <laughs> we need to be your official sponsors or some or whatever that is, representatives or something. Because that's perfect. Yeah. But I need to change out of this. Yes. But we're so thankful and yeah, thank you so it's much. a nice kickoff to the weekend and it's a great little little piece of get like the holidays really started because it's like starting, especially with our you know, the busy week you'll see we have. Yes. Oh, sorry, she really likes to look <laughs> in my hand. So you all know Sarah works from home. But what you may not see, because we don't do too much um, home vlogging during the day and there's a good reason, it's because Sarah is extremely regimented in her day. It's how she gets all the work that she does do at home during normal business hours so we can go play when I get home. So she's always so busy so when I come home like this it always throws her off because I'm a distraction. So I have Eve. Sarah closed herself in the second bedroom where she has a made up an office. I have Yes Virginia. There is a Santa Claus. I'm gonna watch this even though it's a shorty because I don't think she has too much work to do. But sh there's a secret. We have a very special package coming today. And I told Sarah because it, it was delayed because it was coming from California. It was delayed to come on Monday, but I got an update today. It's coming today. It's out for delivery. UPS says it's coming between 2 and 6. I'm hoping it shows up before we leave for the day. And Sarah doesn't know it's coming today, so it'll be a surprise for her. Shh. Look where we are. And it's 3 o'clock. We're going to meet one of Sarah's cousins. Who has a house down here that comes down for a couple weeks at a time? But I don't know how long this trip is. I think it's a week this time. Yeah, she's just coming a week, so this might be one of the one of the one or one of the two times we'll see her. We got fancy drinks. I got tea. But we're at Fonterra Express. We've we got, never eaten here we got we got the pork tacos and some mm -hmm. chips and guac. So let's let's see how this is. I got I forgot your water. Let me go get it. All right. The weird thing is, is we left Disney Springs, and now we're at Celebration. Yeah. And it feels like a fall night. Yeah. Like this feels Ooh, like and the wind. there's even wind and there's leaves on the ground. So we're in Celebration to go check out the the, the snow and the, the lights here. But I wanted to show you this is a Chicagoan. This is proof that we used to live in downtown Chicago with a vehicle. Important disclaimer there. With a vehicle. Look at this park. With job. a Jeep Grand Cherokee. Yes. Big car. Look at that. With a black car. Look at that right there. And that much right there. We made sure that card enough to get out, and we made sure that card enough to get out. Not much, but they can. But look at that park job. Ready? Impressive. Yeah. Well, you 
It was a team effort. You spotted me, and I did the the, ur the urkin forward you're and good. back. You're good. You're good. Stop. Me and Peter keep bumping at each other because you're like, what yeah. are you doing? Look at there's a menorah over there. Look, there's a little dance show going on. Look at this. This is like a little rascal, so they have the frog in there. <laughs> <laughs> this is adorable. Look at this. It's eight, yeah, it's 80, 80 degrees outside, but we can still ice skate here in Celebration, Florida. Look at this celebration tree. It's pretty nice. And they got these cute gingerbread family and all these presents in front of it. And look how creepy and dark this lake looks at nighttime. Be careful, there's stairs right here. I see. Okay. <laughs> Sarah, Sarah I was going to take a tumble. <laughs> but here's the Celebration, Florida tree. Oh, and we found out that the snow yeah, so it'll be there in 10 minutes. And here's one of the horse drawn. This is a horse drawn sleigh, as they call it. Look at that. A lot of fun. 55 bucks for a ride up to four. Santa's here. He's supposed to be busy for the next two weeks. But you can buy your tickets here. Oh, you know, that is for the train ride. Nice. Santa's got a house. Rudolph option, Dasher option. Oh, I bet it's like a fast pass line kind of thing. That's cute. First line for Santa. We're not going to meet him today, but you can drop off your, your letter to him here. Got a little sneak peek. Mrs. Claus is in there too. Right there. Hey, Santa. Sarah spotted some carolers to listen to right before the snow starts. It's beginning. Sarah, it's beginning. the Cinderella carriage. I think this was $65 for up to four. So I think this Market Street uh, at Celebration is amazing, but especially right now because the street's closed for the whole season. And you can just like come out here, have a pizza, have some drinks and, and appetizers with friends. And it's just like a whole ambiance now. I love it. With Disney Springs happening earlier and me getting off work earlier and us coming here earlier, we get to go home earlier, which means more belly rubbing time for Eve. And we get to watch some Christmas movies and spend the night at home. Which we haven't done this Christmas Eve. Oh my god, oh my god, you guys. Look at this truck. Celebration bike rental tours and more. This old fashioned vintage truck with a Christmas tree in the back. There is a Christmas tree in the back, Sarah. And it says, wish you a Merry Christmas. So we're creeping on some houses in Celebration to see which ones have the best decorations. This one is pretty good. Oh yeah. Look at it all going on. Flashing lights, inflatables, all the I goods. Like this, one this one, yeah, this one's just delicately done. This, this metal one? Oh, and the chandelier on the inside. A plus. Oh, this is it. This is dedication. That's dedication. They got so many Santas. Look at those and big nutcrackers. Nutcrackers, and there's a Father Christmas. 
and a beautiful nativity. Oopsie. Oopsies is right. We did, we went to like, we looked up like nice houses decorated in celebration. And this is like a whole, this was like one of these houses while well, it was on like one of the best decorated in all of Orlando. How cute. This whole block was like very well decorated. This is where it's at. This is where it's at. Some BB-8, R2-D2. <gasps> it's like Osborne Lights. Christmas is, oh, this is where Tim and Jen sing it from. From this song. They have a snowblower too. Wow, and there's a dancing mic. Wait, there's a projection over here. Eight, eight, one. Oh! That's so cool. This is called the Great, the Great Christmas Light Fight. That sign over there says. Oh, they have another classic like Christmas movie being projected into that window. This is amazing. We came at the perfect time because it like literally went dark and it started. Yeah. And we came on the, the opposite side of this popular way to do it, so we have a, a curb spot. <gasps> it's not over yet. Ready? Ready. We're home. We took Eve out. She's all set. She's good. She's ready. It's early. It's 8 o'clock. So we're ready to have a good time. We're gonna relax, watch some Christmas movies tonight. But we wanted to show you something and talk to you about how we go to the parks because we got a really, really cool gift tonight. Mm -hmm. And so it has to do with our awesome Mickey bag. And we got this on Amazon years ago and it's done us such a good service. Maybe like a year and a half. We use this for everything, but it's starting to get worn. It's the all bag, getting frayed. I'll, I'll show you the bag. It's falling apart. I mean, it's pretty, it's in good condition. Like, it's for not like, for it. how much we use it. It's done a really good job. But for how we show our adventures and the, the, the stuff we bring, whether it's snacks or batteries, we just got like stuff thrown in here. I mean, it's, it's organized to a point, but it's just not really functional. So, why we show you this is because we got this box when we got home. And what this box is, is probably like the fanciest thing that's happened since we started this vlog. Mm -hmm because this box is from Low Pro Bag, which makes like, has been, it's over 50 years old, and they've been making bags forever, and they wanted to send us this bag, this box, of some goodies. Super fancy, we got a, a 3K Gorilla Pod. I didn't realize it was gonna be that big. Yeah, and this can like, this can hold our G7X, our DSLR, anything, and it's actually great because if you remember in, when we were in Chicago, I accidentally broke our little um, tripod. And I had to super glue it. They have sent us some awesome swag. Some lens cleaners. This some is like a tag. Luggage tags, some pens. So really cool stuff. They make great you know what? I don't even know if Sarah remembers this, but we our DSLR bags that Sarah's had since college is actually a low pro bag that we got. But this is the creme de la creme. This right here is gonna be our new Parks signature backpack. signature backpack. Why don't you give it a rip open? Like I said, this is like the craziest thing that happened to us. They were like, you you guys make great videos, you guys, we would love to send you this to help you out with being organized and safe with our <laughs> with our luggage, or with our like equipment. This is awesome, we wanna show you how we're gonna do this now, cause it's got a compartment in top. Now let's show them how it opens up. So this is where it's at. Look at that, this is all customizable and safe and protected and it's gonna make our lives so much easier. Now Zippers. we can put batteries and memory cards, this camera is equipment. It's gonna be, it's gonna be, it's gonna be life changing I think. It's yeah. really gonna change how we go through security, how we. Another important thing is actually, didn't Jen Sessions back have this? And you gotta close that. Sorry. Yeah. The bottom here, I don't want to take it all out, but this right here 
is like a, sl a light slight I think it's water resistant, but it's like waterproof, yeah. slight water resistant, and it wraps around the whole backpack, so you can still wear the backpack while having it waterproof. Yeah, so obviously it rains here. Um, so that'll be super helpful. We'll open that back up. Look at that. Look at all that space right there. Woo! Woo! Look at that. All set and secure. We have all with the G7 X will be in our pocket. Then we've got two. Oh. Eve is fighting her shadow in the oven. <laughs> <laughs> two, three, four. Four cameras with us. Another lens, our gimbal, our batteries. We are going to be ready for every scenario. And look at this cool thing on the back. The Gorilla Pod attaches like clips to the bottom of it. Up top has our ponchos. Our ponchos, and buttons. buttons, and pins for trading. And other good stuff. And medicine, and deodorant, and all of that. Lip balm. And right here, super important. Festival of the Holidays booklet, so we never forget it again. How's it feel? Good. We gotta like adjust wanna, it to me. I don't think we should like loosen it too loosey goosey. I think it all needs to stay. Yeah, but we should adjust it to like, yeah. look at that, it looks great. You usually. It's not too, I was worried it's gonna be a little too small, like in size. Yeah, no. But it looks great. Now let's adjust We're it. We're gonna add some buttons to it. Yeah, yeah, get some flair on there. Some pins. And kind of like how do we have it on here? Yeah. Thanks, Lopro. Yeah, thank you so much. We'll let you know. We have to test it out, make sure that everything is good, make sure it feels good in the parks and everything. Mm -hmm. Give it the old security test to make sure security is... E I assume security is going to be even easier. Yeah, because usually we have to take like, our battery thing out, our gimbal thing out. And they like are all freaked out by putting their hands in a mysterious deep bag with yeah. all kinds of it stuff on like, it. Zoop. Zoop. Mm -hmm. Perfect. I can't wait. So... It's not as early anymore, but it's because we realized, hey, we still haven't taken our photo for our Christmas cards. So that was a whole debacle because we'd like move furniture, we wanted to be in front of our tree, and then we tried having Eve in it. So then it was like, the first two shots were great because we did a timer on our nice camera and she didn't understand the noise, so she was like... She was like, hmm? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, so it worked and then she got sick of it and then didn't want to stand anymore or let us hold her for it. So we took photos of ourselves and then she calmed down and then we tricked her into taking more photos. Tomorrow will be an interesting day. Um, we got some, both of us have unique things going on. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm definitely gonna go to City Walk. I'm pretty sure I'm going fishing friends. still, but with the weather how it is, there, there's a chance it might not happen. Mm -hmm. um, so we'll see. I hope I go. <laughs> if not, we'll figure out some good plans. Mm -hmm. um, it'll be great anyway, so. Yeah. Thank you for following along today. We're gonna go watch Polo Express, but actually like relax and watch it. So I don't wanna not sign off now and sign off in five hours from now when we wake up at two in the morning on the couch like, huh. So thank you for following along with us. And it's, it's good, good to be, be home. home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>